One of the titans that we are covering today has a bite so big and so powerful that it can break bone. Hi everyone, my name is Jeff and today we are covering 10 of the biggest and creepiest crawlers this world has to offer. But before we jump into the world of the mini goliaths, if you're new to the show, would you be so kind as to slap that subscribe button and hit the bell so you don't miss out on the 10 amazing animals we'll cover in the future. Please and thank you. Now, let's get into the creepy. Number 10, Giant Weta. The name Weta comes from the Maori word Wetapunga, which means God of Ugly Things. Oh no, he didn't. <laughs> Females look pretty tame and resemble giant cicadas. And although the males have massively scary mandibles, they are not the insects that can break bone that we've been talking about. The mandibles are still impressive though. In some cases, the giant weta weighs more than a mouse, making it the heaviest insect in the world. It's so heavy in fact that it is unable to jump. This is one of 70 species of weta in New Zealand. And to add to the quote, ugly factor, these giant weta have their ears on the knees of their front legs. I mean, because why would you want ears anywhere else? All right, that's it. I'm out of here. Number nine, Atlas Moth. Found across Southeast Asia and Malaysia, these huge moths have a wingspan reaching over 10 inches the largest of any moth in the world. Female atlas moths are both larger and heavier than the males. However, neither adult sex of the moths have mouths, meaning they live only for a few days. And as you can guess, those few days are used for making babies. Number eight, giant huntsman spider. Considered the biggest spider by leg span, which can reach up to 12 inches long. That's what she said. The giant huntsman spider actively hunts down prey. Regular huntsman spiders are found all over the world, but the giant huntsman spider is found in Laos and was only recently discovered in 2011. These cave dwellers might look terrifying to arachnophobes, but the poison from their bites is pretty mild. And although it can cause nausea and headaches, more often than not, their bite doesn't really affect the average healthy human. Still hurts though. Number seven, Giant Gippsland Earthworm. These giant earthworms can stretch up to 10 feet in length. That being said, it is kind of difficult to measure a worm, as they will often stretch out and shrink up whenever they want to. So scientists use weight to estimate their size. The average weight of a fresh adult worm is about 200 grams. So they weigh about the same amount as a good can of soup. Tasty. The worms are found in the Bass River Valley of South Gippsland. They live in burrows about 20 inches deep and can dig very, very deep into the soil. The worms only lay a single egg, between 4 to 7 centimeters in size. These can take up to one year to hatch, and the worms take several years after that to become full-grown adults. And as far as specialists know, these worms only have a lifespan of about 5 to 6 years. Number 6, Giant Walking Stick. The longest insect is a newer discovery for China. First found in 2014, the giant stick insect, or the giant walking stick, can grow up to two feet long. Stick insects aren't venomous, but if threatened, they will do whatever is needed to get away. Some will regurgitate a nasty substance to put a bad taste in a hungry predator's mouth. <laughs> while others take it to the next level and reflex bleed. What is reflex bleeding? Well, when it comes to these stick insects, they start to ooze a foul-smelling hemolymph from joints in their body. That doesn't just smell nasty, but I can only imagine tastes horrible. Number five, Queen Alexandra's birdwing. The largest butterfly in the world with a wingspan of up to 12 inches, Queen Alexandra's birdwing is something that will make you second guess what you're seeing. Alexandra bird wings are so big that they're able to chase away birds in their territory. These butterflies are pretty defensive of their position and have been known to attack animals of similar size who get too close. This butterfly is found in Papua New Guinea and is an endangered species. And the craziest thing is that they are now so rare that wealthy collectors are willing to pay upwards of 8,000 
to $10,000 for one. Which is crazy because not only are they endangered, but they also only have a total lifespan of about 13 months. <laughs> Number four, giant forest scorpion. These super-sized scorpions are native to India, where they eat a wide variety of prey. They're solitary animals and they can be found day or night. They are the biggest and heaviest scorpions in the world, with the largest of these species getting as long as nine inches. That's almost the same size as a spatula. <coughs> now, while they do have venom like other scorpions to use as necessary, it's not their primary way they choose to hunt. Instead, similar to constrictor type snakes, these scorpions crush their prey with their powerful pinchers before enjoying their hard-earned meal. Number three, black sea hare. These sea slugs, also known as the California sea hare, are incredibly massive, with a length of about 30 inches and a maximum weight of about 15 pounds. Because of the toxins in its body that come from consuming algae, the California sea hare has very few predators. When it becomes irritated, the sea hare is capable of releasing not one, but two different kinds of ink, much in the way an octopus does. One ink is reddish purple and is your standard blackout ink making it hard to see, while the other is milky white and is a toxic chemical that is noxious to predators and rapidly dissuades them from feeding. Number two, Scolopendra giant centipedes. Scolopendra giant centipedes are the largest of the centipedes and pack a nasty pinch. These huge centipedes are found across the tropics in South and Central America, Asia, the Caribbean, Australia, and more. They're in my hair! They're in my hair! <laughs> Some of the over 100 species are exceptionally aggressive, can hunt in almost any terrain, and have a specially designed venom to quickly incapacitate their prey. Giant centipedes are carnivores and will eat small animals that they can attack and kill. This can include mice, frogs, lizards, birds, snakes, spiders, and insects. And even humans are not immune to their strong venom. Now before we cover our number one pick for the biggest and creepiest, let's go over our honorable mentions. The Goliath Bird Eater Spider. The Giant Burrowing Cockroach. And the Giant Dobson Fly. All right, now let's see who is the biggest and creepiest contender of them all. Number one, the Titan Beetle. Found in the tropical rainforest of South America, the Titan Beetle can grow up to seven inches in length, making it the largest species of beetle in the entire world. If you are lucky enough to hear this firsthand, you'll never forget it. Now, if that screeching doesn't get you, the biting might. These animals have exceptionally robust mandibles and can give a very, very nasty nip if they feel threatened. It is said that their powerful jaws can cut through a pencil, twigs, or even fingers. And although these bugs are not necessarily aggressive, they do have a tendency to bite through whatever finds itself between its mandibles. If there was one creepy crawler out of this whole list that makes my skin personally crawl more than the rest, it would probably have to be the giant centipede. Yeah, I've had more than one nightmare about those things. But out of all the king crawlers we covered, which one would you be most afraid of? If any, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit subscribe, smash that like button, and hit that bell so you don't miss out on future episodes. As always, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you back here next time as we cover 10 more amazing animals. These giant hornets will be back.